Greetings respectable viewers, I hope you are doing very well. Welcome to the ODC markets and here I am going to present you a very good strategy that absolutely works in the weekdays but is excellent in the ODC markets. What I need to tell you about this strategy uh, is that its name is very popular, it's shocks and pressure strategy. Shots and pressure strategy is going to help you a lot in every sort of market situation whenever you feel down or you feel in loss. So let's in, uh, go towards the implementation of the strategy. After the implementation, um, where I'll illustrate you the strategy, the rules of it, the conditions of it that you need to follow. And after all, um, I'll trade live for you people on this particular strategy. All you need to do is that you need to follow the rules that I'll be telling you. That are the most important thing I have brought for you people that you need to acknowledge. Well, let's move towards the implementation of the strategy. Implementation of strategy is just like a matter of a second, okay? You need not worry about that. Well, you need to select the chart type as candles for this particular strategy and there I have selected it candles. Now what you need to do is you need to set the candle time period. Candle time period will be set at 1 minute or 2 minute time frame for this particular strategy. Um, well, I should, I should go with 1 minute. Okay, so that I can execute some live trading for you people for this particular strategy. Now, what you need to do is you, you need to remember what shocks and pressure are before we go towards the rule. And the most interesting thing is that there is no other implementation regarding this strategy. That's all, that's all, and we have to follow the rules now. Um, well, uh, the one minute time period, candle time period means that each candle is showing you a fluctuation of one minute. This is for the beginners, okay? I'm just telling. Okay, now as far as shocks and pressure is concerned, these both are two different phases, shocks and pressure. Well, as far as shocks are concerned, whenever you see an abrupt movement in the candlestick, which is a rare time, when it happens that's a shock most of the times in the markets it's a it's a pressure pressure is the slow slide and a gradual movement of the candle somewhere in a buy trend or a sell trend now at this point of time as you are watching the chart it's again a pressure it's not a shock shock is a very rare time frame time uh, activity it's like uh, if there is a news in the market if, if it's like uh, uh, if the market is going to open opening time of the market there are some shocks and sometimes in between the market times but mostly it's a pressure game okay so you need to understand that you need you can trade more with pressure instead of shocks now as far as the rules of all this game are concerned i'm going to tell you each and every rule to remember it before you start trading so that you need not to miss any point that can hurt you and hurt you in the sense of your loss i i just want you people to remember each and every rule that is very important so as far as uh, rule one is concerned it's if the pressure is upwards you know, there is a buy trend in the candle okay uh, just like now it's a pressure upwards and shocks are also existing in the candle and they are also towards upside in a buy trend you need to put a sell trade you need to put a lower trade you need to put a put option but there are no shocks right now remember this thing okay it's just a pressure upwards well if the pressure is downwards if a pressure is downwards and shocks are also downwards you need what do you need to do yeah you got it try you need to put a uh, buy trade you need to put a higher trade that, that's a vice versa situation okay you need to put a call option um that's a vice versa situation these both rules are 
opposite to each other that I told you. Now, the second set of rules that I need to tell you are again opposite to each other. If pressure is moving upwards, okay, just like now, this is a buy candle in the making and pressure moves upwards whenever there is a buy candle in the making, okay? It's a green candle, okay? If pressure is moving upwards and shocks are existing and moving downwards in a sell trend, pressure in a buy trend and uh, shocks in the sell trend what do you need to do you need to trade sell you need to put a lower trade you need to put a put option for this particular trade okay if the pressure is downwards if the pressure is downwards and that means it's a red candle in the making and the shocks are upwards it's again a vice versa situation just like the previous rule was opposite to it shocks are upwards what do you need to do you need to trade in the direction of the shocks you need to put a buy trade a higher trade a call option okay so we are done with most of the rules in the last but not the least and the most important rule is that that is if there is no shocks which is most of the times the case in the market and only pressure exists what would you do that's the most of the times you can act on it. It's a very good rule. The direction in which pressure is, you need to trade in that direction. If the pressure is simply in a red candle, if the, there is a sell candle in the making, you need to put a sell trade. If there is a buy candle in the making, if the pressure is in a buy candle, you need to put a buy trade. Okay, I hope you understand this point and these these were very simple rules do remember them before you trade do let me know if you have any sort of queries regarding this particular strategy i'll be there to assist you people don't worry about that and i'm all available to assist you as much as i can other than that um, do reach me out for your account collaboration for purposes uh, my contact details mentioned at the end of the video i'm all available to assist you uh, do subscribe the channel do share the videos with your loved ones who really want to be into real trading i'm all available to assist every one of you and i'll try to respond as soon as possible um do watch out other thoroughly tested profitable strategies videos as well and now let's switch towards the live trading session that can help you a lot to enjoy the practical experience of this particular strategy till then stay safe stay connected we'll see each other very soon have a good time
respectable viewers i hope you liked the video for more informational stuff stay tuned to the channel for that purpose you need to subscribe it press the bell notification button for upcoming updates i've been into trading since years and i aim to impart all that knowledge in you people all those skills and experience in you people in like few time and that is uh, summarized in these video tutorials i hope you liked all these video tutorials for more informational stuff keep on watching them and for any sort of suggestions you can write me in the comment either it is a positive or negative feedback even i appreciate everything other than that for any collaborative ideas or any sort of queries that you want to get resolved you can contact me on my personal details mentioned in the video description uh, and in the channel description i hope to stay punctual so together we can win and uh, we can reward each other by working as a team yeah so everything is free of cost for you people in this channel i hope to stay punctual for you people and uh, i hope that uh, this gets much bigger as a family in the future take care bye bye see you soon